Sometimes you have to be a bitch to get things done. If fate means you to lose, then give him a good fight anyhow. Whenever you have a little bit of time for yourself, read a book. Always carry something with your characters written in on it. And with you and look at it when no one else is looking. Hold every moment sacred. Don't be afraid because you're not going to be afraid. But remember, when you become afraid, just don't be afraid. Never be afraid. Never contend with a man who has nothing to lose. Always in the circumstances wear comfortable shoes. You never know what you may run into in your life. And if you don't fail at 90% all the time, then you're really not aiming high enough. Never play checkers with a man who carries his own board. Watch the glittering eyes in the whole world around you because the greatest secrets are always hidden in the most unlikely places. It's okay to be fat. If you're fat, just be fat and shut up about it. As long as you live, keep learning how to live. Avoid foolhardiness. Do not attempt to match in six opponents at a race. Restrain your ambition. This will benefit you. It is no shame to flee from four or six. Tip graciously. You go around only once. Tipping graciously is a meaningful way to improve your own quality of life. And if you're going to be crazy, you have to get paid for it, or else you're going to be locked up. Live like a mudfish. Its skin is bright and shiny, and even though it's living in the mud. If you say that there's an elephant flying in the sky, people are not going to believe you. But if you say that there's a 425 elephants in the sky, people will probably believe you. Don't ever forget two things that I'm going to tell you. One, don't believe everything that's written about you. And two, don't pick up too many checks. It's okay to be wrong. And don't hold your parents up to contempt. After all, you are their son and it's possible, just possible, that you may just take after them. Something to think about is if you fish in the wrong fly long, hard enough, you will sooner or later become the right fly. Something to think about. If you fish the wrong fly long and hard enough, it will sooner or later become the right fly. Put all your eggs in one basket and watch that basket. You never want to give a man a present when he knows he's feeling good. You want to do it when he's not feeling good. Gamble everything for love. If you are a true human being, gamble it all for love. The important thing is not to stop questioning. Curiosity has its own reasons for existing. One cannot help but to be in the awe of the contemplating mysteries of the eternity, of life, and the marvelous structure of reality. It's enough for one to try merely to comprehend a little of their mystery every day. Never lose the holy curiosity. Albert Einstein Keep away from people who try to belittle your ambitions. Small people always do that. But the really great people, they're the ones who make you feel and become great. Don't worry about people stealing an idea. If it's original, you'll have to ram it down their throat. Love with your mouth shut. Help without breaking your ass and publicizing it. And keep cool and care. It is fatal to look hungry. It makes people want to kick you. What's that old saying? Don't look back. Somebody might be catching up. Well, don't even slow down, much less look back. Don't carry because it's over. And don't cry because it's over. Smile because it happened. It pays to be obvious. It pays to be obvious, especially if you have a reputation for subtly. Smoked carp tastes just as good as smoked salmon when you ain't got no smoked salmon. And whenever you ask if you could, if you can get the job, tell them, certainly I can. Then get busy and find out how to do it. Why not be oneself? That is the whole secret of a successful appearance. If one is a greyhound, why try to look like a Pekingese? Take calculated risks. That is quite different from being rash. And don't have any ideas if you aren't willing to be responsible for them. When I first started racing my father, one of the first things he said, he said, win the race as slow as you can. And if you want to grow old as a pilot, you've got to know when to push it and when to back off. The three sentences that will get you through life. Number one, cover me. Number two, Oh, good idea, boss. Number three, it was like, it was like that when I got there. Have fun and go home when you're tired. If you end up with a boring, miserable life because you listen to your mom, your dad, your sister, your teacher, your priest, some guy in television telling you how to do your shit, then you deserve it. It's not only what happens to you, but how you react to it that matters. Dare to be naive. Stick to your story. It's not the most important subject in history, but it's the one from which you are uniquely qualified to speak. Never run away from a gun. Bullets can travel faster than you can. And if you are praised, be silent. If you are scolded, be silent. If you incur a loss, be silent. If you receive profit, be silent. If you are satiated, by si be silent. If you are hungry, be silent. And do not be afraid that there will be no fruit when all dies down. There will be fruit. Not everything will die down. Energy will appear. And what energy? 
Don't ever ask anyone for an opinion of your performance. They're liable to tell you. You should assume everything you read online is false until you can confirm it elsewhere. And never throw a long line when a short one will serve your purpose. Be yourself. Everyone else is already taken. Remember, upon the conduct of each depends the fate of all. A good hockey player plays where the puck is. A great hockey player plays where the puck is going to be. The big secret in life is that there is no big secret. Be daring, be different, be impractical, be anything that will assert integrity of purpose and imaginative vision against the play it safers, the creatures of the commonplace, the slaves of the ordinary. Get and stay out of your comfort zone. I believe that not much happens of any significance if you're always in your comfort zone. Exposing money in a public place is pretty stupid. Do not go to the bed or bed fearing tomorrow. When, for when the day breaks, what is tomorrow? Remember always that you have not only the right to be an individual, you have an obligation to be one. You cannot make any useful contributions in the life unless you do that. It is not enough to conquer. One must also know how to seduce. You have to learn how to duck because they're going to throw it at you anyway. The first rule of life is to have a good time. The second rule of life is to hurt as few people as possible. There is no third rule, so just have a good time. You have to grow from the inside out. Don't worry about mosquitoes. Don't worry about flies. Don't worry about insects in general. Never murder a man who is committing suicide. You must knock on doors until your knuckles bleed. Doors will slam in your face, but you must pick yourself up, dust yourself off, and knock again. It's the only way to achieve your goals in life. The first rule is to keep an untroubled spirit. The second is to look things in the face and know them for what they are. Be aware that people are not operating in the very condensed version of the Ten Commandments and the part about murder. Be happy. It's only one way of being wise. Don't aim at success. The more you aim at it, the more you make a target. The more you're going to miss it. For success is like happiness. You cannot, it cannot be pursued. It must, be, it must ensue. And it only does as the unintended side effect of one's personal dedication to a cause greater than oneself as to a byproduct of one's surrender to a person other than oneself. Happiness must happen at the same holds for success. You have to let it happen by not caring about it. What people talk, listen completely. People want, people never listen. I understand that fear is my friend, but not always. It should always be in front of you, like the thing that might have to be killed. If you judge people, you have no time to even love them. There's only one way to become a hitter. Go up to the plate and get mad. Get mad at yourself and get mad at the pitcher. Never pay attention to what critics say. Remember, a statue has never been put up in honor of a critic. Be warned against all good advice because good advice, necessarily safe advice, and though it's undoubtedly follow the same patterns, it will very likely lead one into a total sterility, one of the crushing problems of our time. And if your only goal is to become rich, then you will never achieve it. When in doubt, make a fool of yourself. There is no microscopically thin line between being brilliantly creative and acting like the most gigantic idiot on earth. So what the hell? Leap! Put yourself in the shoes before you decide the best way to take their shirts. Hit the ball over the fence and you could take your time going around the bases. Never pass up the opportunity to have sex or to be on television. Life is one big contradiction and if you drive yourself crazy, if you try to figure it out, so don't. Enjoy every sandwich. Study nature, love nature, stay close to nature, and it will never fail you. Whatever you can do or dream, you can begin it. Boldness has genius and power and magic in boldness. You can never go home again, but the truth is that you can never leave home, so it's all right. If you go something, if you've got something you don't want other people to know, then keep it in your pocket. Don't underestimate the value of doing nothing of just going along listening to all the things you can't hear and not bothering make a careful list of all the things done to you that you have been honored and don't do them to others and don't do them that you've been aboard and don't do them to others ever make a list of things done to you that you loved and do them to others always do not conceive that fine clothes make fine men any more than fine feathers make fine birds nothing that easy comes in worth of dime as a matter of fact, I never saw a football player make a tackle with a smile on his face. Never. Shall we make a new rule in life from tonight? Always to try to be a little kinder than necessary. And if you can't be kind, at least be vague.